All right, we also have a breaking input coming in, a, a tweet by Jairam Ramesh. Uh, now, according to this particular tweet, you know, the opposition stand is quite clear. They're insisting on the statement of the Prime Minister. INDIA demands Prime Minister's statement in the House. Jairam Ramesh has tweeted and we have Mohit joining us with more details on that. Mohit, opposition is insisting on the Prime Minister's statement in both houses. Well, party today will be a very political charge up there in the parliament while the opposition party... They basically say that the Prime Minister should make a statement on the floor of the House. They basically say to the Prime Minister for the first time, spoke on Manipur, but just for a 30 second, not inside the premises of the Parliament. They want a statement on the floor of the House. And hence, that will be the demand by various opposition parties. And we see various opposition leaders have already given a German motion and they want a discussion on the on the issue of Manipur and they demand a statement coming in from none other than the Prime Minister Narendra Modi on the issue. While the BJP from past two days they have been addressing various press conferences, they said that they are ready for the discussion, but the opposition is trying to disrupt the proceedings of the House. Now the BJP says that yes, discussion should be there on Manipur, but they also say that the discussion should also be there on West Bengal, the atrocities of women in Bengal and also the law and order and the crime against uh, women that are happening in the state of Rajasthan. So the BJP says they are ready for the discussion and debate, but the opposition parties say that they want specifically on Manipur the statement from the Prime Minister, while the opposition also says that they do not want short, uh, short duration uh, debate, uh, because the opposition says that if there is a short duration debate, then uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi is not bound to give statement in the floor of the House. They can depute any other MOS or the Home Minister, but they want the, 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 uh, the statement from the Prime Minister. So again, we'll see that how the opposition parties will come out and they might also protest in front of the Gandhi statue at around 10.30. Before that, they will have a meeting while the BJP says that they are ready for discussion, but the opposition is just trying to divert the issue. They're trying to politicize the issue. And they're specifically talking about Bengal, but not talking about the crime against women in the states of Rajasthan and West Bengal. So we have to wait and watch what exactly will happen in the parliament. Remember, uh, when the last time parliament uh, convened, there was a complete workers, then it was being adjourned. So what exactly will happen today, that remains to be seen. But the whole country needs a debate on the issue of Manipur. So whether that happens today, whether again the disruption will happen, whether again... Uh, we'll see that how the BJP will raise questions of the opposition and opposition vice versa will be raising questions on the on the on the uh, on the clause of the debate that remains to be seen. So at around 10:30 we'll get to know that what exactly will happen inside the parliament. Opposition have made it clear they want statement from Prime Minister Narendra Modi. You know, Mohit, it looks like the logjam won't end soon because the opposition. Uh, uh, demands statement of the Prime Minister in the House. The BJP is alleging that the government is ready for a discussion, but it's the opposition that is now trying to deflect and change the goalpost. Well, Swati, that has been the uh, allegation from the BJP side saying that we were ready uh, to debate and discuss on this particular issue on the first day of the parliament, but that, that did not happen because the opposition is just trying to gain political mileage from the issue of Manipur. And then the BJP came out with various press conferences where they attack the opposition saying that they are being very, very selective when it comes to crime against women in the states of Rajasthan and West Bengal. While the opposition says that you cannot compare what has happened in Manipur to what is happening in West Bengal and Rajasthan, the action has been taken against crime against women in those two states. But in Manipur, it's been two months. Even the chief minister and their elected home minister did not know about this incident. It's only when the the video went viral, the action is now being initiated. So the BJP also says, the government says they are ready for discussion. Come, have a discussion with us. Uh, don't just speak on the which, which, under what clause uh, the discussion should take place. Well, the opposition have made it clear that unless and until there will be a statement coming in from the Prime Minister Narendra Modi on the floor of the House, they will uh, continue their demand, they will continue with their protest. So hence, it would be very difficult, Swati, as you were saying, uh, to end this particular log jam inside the Right, absolutely. In fact, you know, in fact, uh, Mohit, the day has begun and so have the notices.